This brief video poses a question to YouTube user Shock of God, but first a little background. Shock of God's profile has been raised somewhat by asking atheists the following question. What proof and evidence can you provide that atheism is accurate and correct? I must add that he refuses to acknowledge what the definition of atheism actually is. The many people who have adequately addressed this question find themselves censored and blocked from his channel. He also has a phone in radio show where the would-be adversary is shouted down, talked over and cut off mercilessly. All this speaks volumes for the type of mentality that we are dealing with here. In truth, of course, you cannot disprove a negative claim as many people have already pointed out to him. Here are some of the more common rebuttals to his question. Shock of God cannot prove that pink unicorns do not exist. Shock of God cannot prove that the revelation to Muhammad by Gabriel did not happen. Shock of God cannot prove that Zeus does not exist. Shock of God cannot prove that not more than one God exists, my favourite. Shock of God would not be able to answer this question, when did you stop beating your wife? I am sure you have heard all these rebuttals and more before. Shock of God deep down knows that the onus is upon the claimant to provide proof and evidence. That is why he is literally cornered into this defensive question. The skeptic has every right to reject such a positive claim until the claimant proves otherwise. So I want to ask Shock of God just one question. Yes, Shock of God, this is directed at you. Who is the pervert in your logo disrobing that young choir boy? No, that's not the question. The question that I really want you to address is this. What proof and evidence can you provide that atheism is not accurate and correct? Shock, are you man enough to address this question?